With the heat rising in northern San Luis Obispo County this week, the Recreation Department in the city of Paso Robles is making sure anyone participating in activities or camps are safe. KSBY's Eduardo Wehon Jr. has more on how kids are beating the heat this summer. Temperatures are quite hot right now in North County and recreational leaders are making sure that kids and adults are preventing heat illnesses on their watch. According to the CDC, more than 700 people die from extreme heat every year in the United States. Young children in particular can get sick from the heat if they participate in physical activities during hot weather. Heat-related illnesses and deaths are preventable, so camp leaders are taking precautions by keeping kids hydrated and away from the sun as much as they can. We're just getting into the heat wave right now, and so we started implementing more breaks and water bottles. So we're squirting each other with water bottles. We're using watercolor. Um, we're, we are even inside is warm. The CDC says you shouldn't wait to drink water until you're thirsty. Drinking plenty of fluids regardless of how active you are is vital as muscle cramping may be an early sign of heat related illness. We implement uh, safety precautions to go ahead and make sure that we care for the safety of our campers and all the children that come out and play. Uh, and one of the things that we encourage parents to do is make sure the children take, uh, take with them a water bottle of some sort. Despite the hot weather this season, the recreation coordinator for the city of Paso Robles enjoys seeing the public getting involved in the community. Everything that we provide for the community really, it just fills our hearts. That's the reason we do it. We love seeing people come out and enjoy everything that we offer. Seeking shade, wearing a hat and using sunscreen are some tips health officials advise in order to protect your skin from ultraviolet light when participating in outdoor activities. I love aqua aerobics. I'm here every Tuesday and Thursday. It's great fun and great exercise, and on a hot day, it feels great. The city of Paso Robles says they will open up their cooling centers if temperatures exceed 105 degrees for more than three consecutive days. In Paso Robles, I'm Eduardo Wijón, Jr., KSBY News.